Queen of Tears is based on a real-life story of a heroes. Both Lee Bu Jin and Hong Ain are third-generation heroes of major conglomerates. Lee Bu Jin is part of Samsung, a multinational conglomerate, while Hong Ain is part of a fictional queen group in the Korean drama Queen of Tears. Both women are in charge of a significant part of their family business. Lee Bu Jin manages a luxury Australia hotel and a restaurant chain in Seoul. On the other hand, Hong Ain is tasked with managing the Queen Shopping Center. Both women are depicted as beautiful and intelligent, inheriting not just wealth but also business women from their families. They are strong, independent women handling huge responsibilities. Despite their privileged backgrounds, they both face personal challenges. Lee Bu Jin had a very public divorce. Hong Ai deals with the dramatic events of the Queen of Tears plot. Both Imuji and Baekhyun Woo were associated with major conglomerates before their respective marriage. Imuji was technical staff member at Samsung CNT IT department. Baek Hyun Woo joined the Queen Group as a new employee after graduating from prestigious law school. Their educational backgrounds are both impressive but in different fields. Imu Ji is a university graduate, presumably in a field related to IT given his role at Samsung CNT. Baek Hyun Woo, on the other hand, is a law school graduate suggesting a strong background in legal studies. Their financial backgrounds before marriage were different. Emoji described as a Cinderella group, presumably came from a less privileged background compared to Lee Bu Jin. Conversely, Baek Yun Woo's parents own a large countryside farm, indicating a more affluent upbringing. Both men married into powerful families. Emoji married Lee Bu Jin, the Samsung heiress. While Baek Yun Woo's story in Queen of Tears is married with Hong Ain, the hero of Queen Group conglomerate. Their roles within the company was also different. Emoji was a technical staff member suggesting a more hands-on technical role. Baek Yun Woo, with his low degree, likely played a more administrative or legal role within the Queen Group. Lee Bu Jin and Imuji first met at a charity event in 1995 when Lee Bu Jin was working undercover as an intern at Samsung, similar to Hain's story in Queen of Tears. This internship led to a romantic relationship between them, with Imuji supporting Lee Bu Jin and never of her influential background. Their wedding in August 1999 broke societal norms and caused a media sensation much like a TV drama. However, their marriage faced difficulties and Lee Bu Jin filed for divorce in 2014, eventually gaining custody of their son. After just two episodes of Queen of Tears, viewers are curious about how I managed to pursue their family to accept their unconventional marriage. In a parallel, Baek Yun Woo found himself filing for divorce after only two years of marriage. After the wedding, the new Samsung here, presumably Imuji, was sent to the US to study. Arranged by his wife's family, he was required to earn an MBA from MIT, a significant shift from his undergraduate degree. He and his wife, Lee Bu Jin, had a long-distance relationship for seven years, only meeting on special occasions due to their busy schedules. Emuji confessed that preparing to study abroad was the hardest time in his life, to the point where he considered suicide. Just like Emuji, Baek Yun Woo was also pressured by his wife's family to get an MBA in Boston, even though he was a lawyer and represented the conglomerate's legal department. In a heartfelt moment, he shared his feelings with psychiatrists. He'd rather be stabbed than have his father in law find out about his divorce petition. He even thought about kicking him out after their child was born. 
Even though dramas of and make reality seem more romantic, a scriptwriter gives Hong Haiyan and Baek Yoon-woo's marriage a chance for a happily ending, chance for them to understand each other better. Thank you for watching. Click the subscribe button below and notification bell for more updates.